falling for nobody else. Hi guys, so my wife bought some vintage Disney vinyl records online for Alice in Wonderland, Peter Pan, Cinderella and Dumbo. And when they arrived today, I checked these out online and was shocked to see the instant profit she had made. So let's take a look at them, see what the prices are like online, and I'll let you guys guess in the comment section on what she's paid for them. First we have the Walt Disney Alice in Wonderland 1969 Disney Vinyl LP record with the illustrated book on the inside. And this is both vintage and rare. Now online this is £20.58 in the UK and that's even with Elizabeth written all over it. Not one that we'd buy. And in the US you're looking at $50 on Amazon and on eBay anything from around $40 to $50 which in the UK translates to £33 to just over £41. So the best case scenario, buying this online using Google Shopping is £33. Next we have Walt Disney's Peter Pan 1971 Disneyland Vinyl LP record. Now on eBay, you can get this for £19 with postage, but anywhere else it's around £35 to £40. Regardless, £19 is the best price for what looks like a good quality record. Next we have Walt Disney's Cinderella, The Story and the Songs 1969 Disney Vinyl LP record with the illustrated book on the inside and on eBay you're looking at £7.32 but it's in terrible condition. Anything I found close to the quality my wife had bought it in is more like this one for £34 or this one from Australia that would cost £32.50. So we'll say £32.50. And finally, we have Walt Disney's Dumbo 1959 Disneyland Vinyl LP record, and I found this on eBay for £11.50. The quality is great, and this is the best price I could find at this quality. That brings us to a minimum total, from looking in line for these records, of £96. So now the big question. What did my wife spend on them? How much did it cost me? I'm going to give you all a moment to comment your guesses in the comments section. And don't lie, if you didn't get it correct, be honest about it. Note that my wife did get all of the vinyl records from one buyer, so they weren't bought individually. And calculate! Alright, that's enough time. My wife spent a grand total of £25. That's right, £25 for what's worth £96 right now online. That's brilliant. Now, if you've enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. And if you haven't enjoyed this video, unlucky because there's more like this coming to this channel. Catch you later.